let's talk a little bit about how to charge for YouTube videos or any content that you create, whether you're on TikTok, Facebook. Here's a very easy formula for charging for your videos. And, and please note that there are multiple strategies that you could use to get this done. This is just one mechanism that I'm teaching you. What you do is if you have 10 videos, for example, you add up all the views and then you find the average. So let's assume that you have a thousand views on each um, video for 10 videos. Then your average views will be 1000 for those 10 videos and you could have a rate that you're charging your customers which is for example 100 dollars for every thousand views that you get as time goes by and you're probably getting higher views you adjust your rates to suit and your, your even your rate for the thousand views could go up as well so it could go from 150 to 200 because it's based on the demand and you you have inconsistent views that you you know you could say well I charge $150 for every thousand views, $200 for every thousand views, and you, you keep growing in that manner. One of the things I would recommend is never really accepting, like, as a, as a creator, this is like accepting free, a free product that is worth less and saying that you're doing, you know, an ad for somebody based on that, because you could be rubbing yourself in the long run. Now, what happens if <coughs> excuse me <coughs> you know you, you, you make a video and then the views just kind of explode on that particular sponsored video when you enter into an agreement with a customer and ideally it should be a written type agreement when you enter into an agreement you could say well here's what this hundred dollars that i'm charging you for this thousand views if per chance the video does extremely well and it it goes over five thousand views for example then you know you could add to the pot as you go along and the video climbs so that would address the instances where you have viral videos so you're fine to so you're just getting started you probably don't have any um, videos and no really no yardstick to see how to charge you could consider the cost should you find a sponsor definitely right away if you could start doing sponsored videos right away do it because every video that you make it has a cost behind it in terms of the time that you spend filming the time that you spend editing nobody could set your rate you know my rate might be a hundred dollars you might say well i want two hundred dollars off the bat there's a cost attached there's a production cost attached to these things so you know really be wise in terms of um setting your figure and uh, do think that you need to achieve a certain level of perfection before you could start to charge for sponsored videos that is absolutely not true the faster you start is the quicker you could you could you could get a hang of negotiating with people don't be afraid to ask you might be surprised the person if you have no videos and it has somebody in the area with a parlor a mechanic why not go to them and say hey let me charge you 50 dollars for a sponsored video now just to get the ball rolling and they might say well you don't have no views take a chance on me now man right um you know you you could negotiate with your clients based on if it's somebody's corporate you might hold your figures if it's uh, somebody in your area that has a small business you are, you are to some extent when you're in the the youtube content creation you are this a writer it may not be like a professional title and one of the, the quickest uh, skills that you need to develop is asking people and not being afraid of rejection. For instance, when I was making the dal rice and baji video, I reached out to a couple medical labs. I, I, was, I went on Google Maps, found all the medical labs in the area, and I reached out to them in, along the lines of an exchange of service. About 13 or 14 of them said no to me. And that's fine one came along and i want to big up um mikey medical lab and rihanna mohan that's the um the laboratory uh, assistant there for for saying yes to the project so you know don't, don't be afraid of things like rejection what's the most that they could do say no 
you know, you just you just keep going, get your sponsored videos under your belt, and let your your rate increase as you go along. Be mindful of the um. I said kind of be mindful of exclusive type arrangements where you're buying with one person and you start doing sponsored videos right away. Don't ever be afraid to ask. So I hope this was helpful information. Remember, when you're charging for your YouTube videos, if you have videos up already, find the average views of your last 10 videos and then see I, I am charging $100 for every thousand views that I have in the average views. Your rate goes up as you go along and as your view count increase and good luck with your youtube journey if you have any questions that you would like to to ask feel free to throw them down in the comment section and also if you're interested in things that you could do as a small youtuber i'll put a video up there in the end screen that you could click on and thanks for your support if this is your third time here looking at these videos and you aren't subscribed consider subscribing and clicking that like button it helps this work that i am doing on this channel and the other people that i work with it it helps it gets get out to other people so yeah man thanks for your support bye